What's going on YouTube? It's Jay Bird here at Sully Grails Country with another early access sneaker review video. And as you can see, we have another Jordan today. Let's go ahead and show you the front of the box here. The Air Jordan Retro 9. As you can see there, in Concord and yellow. So, let's just go ahead and pull them out. That was enough said right there. This is something I was surprised to see they actually brought back out, but being the fact that the Black Mamba did just retire, it only makes sense to bring out a shoe in honor of him. And here it is. The Jordan 9 Kobe Bryant PE or Laker 9. I mean, I've seen them called both. As of right now, the, the, more, the most official name I've seen is the Kobe Bryant PE. But a little bit more about the shoe. It does feature the white leather upper here and it is like the basic kind of pleather here no no crazy tumble leather or premium leather on this shoe which I wish they would have thrown on it but either way it still doesn't look bad to be honest then you have the Concord here wrapping the entire midsole and then up the back side of the heel around the ankle collar which honestly this Concord in person just really shines and just stands out especially that that patent leather like you see on the 11's um, you have the tour yellow which is the official name for the yellow on this shoe here featured on the tongue where it says Air Jordan and also you'll see it here on the emblem on the heel and on the bottom side also it's featured here on the 23 in the back and it's in the little Jordan logo here also um, white sole nothing nothing crazy going on there but um, like I said you also oh also we got the the chrome eyelets which is that little extra pop for the shoe itself um, these do come out on November 19th, same day as the Vivid Pink 12s. If you haven't seen that, check out that video. Also, we have uh, did an early access video on, but um, very clean shoe. Like I said it just it does it looks really good. Uh, I can't complain about it to be honest. There's nothing really bad to say about it. I wish they would have done the premium leather on it, but I'm still happy with what it is. I think it's something that's gonna make a great addition to any sneaker collection. Or like I said, Laker fan, Kobe fan, non-Laker fan, whatever. I mean, you gotta. You gotta pay respect for what Kobe did, so I think this is a shoe you uh, should definitely put in your collection. Um, in my opinion, I do not think these are gonna sit. I think they're gonna fly off the shelf, so do not sleep on the 19th. Make sure you're out there and uh, get your pair. Put in for your raffles, hit your local sneaker shop, whatever you gotta do, just don't sleep, because I think you're gonna regret it. Also, like I said, if you guys wear a nine and a half, you have some uh, choices out there between the Vivid Pink 12s and also these, so. That's going to be a real fun day for you guys. But uh, let us know what you think in the comments below. Is this something that you think is going to, going to sit on the shelves or going to fly off? Um, also let us know what you think of the shoe itself. Is it something you like? Do you like the colorway? Are you glad they actually brought out the Kobe Bryant PE? But like I said, let us know what you think in the comments. Also make sure you give the video a thumbs up so like I said, if you like what you saw. And then most definitely make sure you subscribe. That way you stay up to date with all of our new content so you don't miss a video. Don't miss miss anything I said because you can like whatever um, I don't know where I was going with that one to be honest but like I said, just bottom line hit the subscribe button also in the description don't forget we'll have all of our uh, links to our social media so snapchat Facebook Twitter Instagram all the stuff you need is down there so go check those out so you can stay up to date and uh, be updated with all kinds of content that we post down there but that is all we have for this shoe so, uh, like I said, let us know what you think, but most importantly, like we always say, wear what you love. This is Jay Birdie with Sully Grail signing out.